thanks for coming back to the channel. We have some great news uh, from Ledger in regards to Ledger Nano S and the Ledger Blue Wallet and the upcoming Bitcoin Gold fork. But before we get to that, a uh, quick look at the price of Bitcoin. And as you can see, we are down 4.51% in the last 24 hours. The price currently stands at $5,853. Early on today, we were actually down to under $5,800 right here. $5,792 um, so about $400 we have lost in the last 24 hours but if you watch my yesterday video I did uh, predict this happening after the fork uh, and that is the fact that uh, when Bitcoin goes up Bitcoin cash goes down when Bitcoin goes down Bitcoin cash goes up and as you can see the price of Bitcoin cash has gone up personally myself I already placed my Bitcoin cash into the exchange waiting for the trade that I will, I will be doing and I have to be honest with you when I saw the price uh, up I sold so currently I have sold my positions on my Bitcoin cash that's 132 Bitcoin cash sold and now I'm waiting and um, let's hope because with cryptocurrency we never know exactly but I do believe uh, possibly as the fork approaches Bitcoin will start pick, uh, pick up again in price and Bitcoin cash we will lose a bit of its value and at that point I'll buy and after the fork uh, I would possibly sell again I, I'm, I'm gonna have to you know wait and see how things develop but here it is and go and watch the video you may find it interesting if you haven't seen it so let's move on now to the ledger and as you can see on the Twitter page we have an official statement from them uh, ledger will add immediate support for the Bitcoin gold fork if when the code is available when replay uh, with replay protection and successful slash valid uh, they will also offer support to transact on the current and segwit 2 exchange with a dedicated website to split as there won't be replay protection so we're gonna stay tuned with that in regards to the segwit 2x but the good news is they will be supporting bitcoin gold which i was expecting to do so i've advised you in previous videos that I also use the Ledger Nano S wallet. Some of you may use the Ledger Blue, which is the bigger uh, version. Um, this is the wallet. If you haven't seen it, this is the one. I'll put a link in it. The, there is actually a link in the description in the comment section if you want to buy yourself one. But we're going to have to have the Bitcoin in the wallet before and on the actual fork, not after the fork. So go back to the Twitter page. Bitcoin Gold will fork on block 491407. And all we have to do is just hold our BTC in a legacy or SegWit address before the fork. So that's a question which I've answered already to quite a few people which uh, obviously didn't know should they hold it in the legacy or the SegWit. They are the same thing. Obviously the SegWit is a little bit quicker, a little bit cheaper. So it doesn't matter in which wallet you're holding your BTC. As long as you're holding it, you know, we will be receiving Bitcoin gold for free nothing else is necessary so we don't have to do absolutely uh, you know nothing else we don't have to do nothing else and we will get our bitcoin gold if the fork does happen so there you have it guys an official from the ledger team that's great news um and i'll put a link in the description to uh, the twitter page as well if you want to go check it out if you have any questions feel free to ask me i hope you enjoyed this video and it's a short video but i think it's an important video especially for the people who are like myself using the ledger nano s or the ledger blue wallet and um, yeah hope you enjoyed it if you're enjoying the channel feel free to subscribe and share and uh, stay tuned for more thank you for watching see you in the next video bye bye from ledger in regards to ledger nano s and the ledger blue wallet and the upcoming bitcoin gold fork but before we get to that a uh, quick look at the price of bitcoin and as you can see we are down 4.51% in the last 24 hours. The price currently stands at $5,853. Early on today, we were actually down to under $5,800 right here, $5,792. Um, so about $400 we have lost in the last 24 hours. But if you watch my yesterday video, I did uh, predict this happening after the fork uh, and that is the fact that uh, when Bitcoin goes up Bitcoin cash goes down when Bitcoin goes down Bitcoin cash goes up and as you can see the price of Bitcoin cash has gone up personally myself I already placed my Bitcoin cash into the exchange waiting for the trade that I will, I will be doing and I have to be honest with you when I saw the price uh, up I sold 
So currently I have sold my positions on my Bitcoin Cash. That's 132 Bitcoin Cash sold. And now I'm waiting and um, let's hope because with cryptocurrency, we never know exactly. But I do believe uh, possibly as the fork approaches, Bitcoin will start pick, uh, pick up again in price and Bitcoin Cash will lose a bit of its value. And at that point I'll buy and after the fork, uh, I would possibly sell again. I, I'm, I'm going to have to, you know, wait and see how things develop. But here it is. And go and watch the video. You may find it interesting if you haven't seen it. So let's move on now to the ledger. And as you can see on the Twitter page, we have an official statement from them. Uh, ledger will add immediate support for the Bitcoin Gold fork if, when the code is available, when replay uh, with replay protection and successful slash valid. Uh, they will also offer support to transact on the current and SegWit2 exchange with a dedicated website to split as there won't be replay protection. So we're going to stay tuned with that in regards to the SegWit2x. But the good news is they will be supporting Bitcoin Gold, which I was expecting to do so. I've advised you in previous videos that I also use the Ledger Nano S wallet. Some of you may use the Ledger Blue, which is the bigger uh, version. Um, this is the wallet. If you haven't seen it, this is the one. I'll put a link in it. There is actually a link in the description in the comment section if you want to buy yourself one. But we're going to have to have the Bitcoin in the wallet before and on the actual fork, not after the fork. So go back to the Twitter page. Bitcoin Gold will fork on block 491407. And all we have to do is just hold our BTC in a legacy or SegWit address before the fork. So that's a question which I've answered already to quite a few people, which uh, obviously didn't know should they hold it in the legacy or the 